What's up everyone? Welcome to another full day of eating. I haven't done these in a while, I know, but you guys requested them down in the comments and so I am following it. And I literally just woke up and I'm in such a good mood. I have so much power because I finally got to sleep enough. The past week I got like three to four hours of sleep. I was jet lagged twice and so it really showed not only at university because I just couldn't memorize anything. It also showed in the yeah my recovery. I just wasn't recovering properly between sessions. So really stoked to see how it will go today because I have an, a push day planned. So chest, shoulders, triceps, as well as quads and calves. And I'm so stoked to see if yeah how much of a difference it will make. And so I'm so energized and finally got to live, man. And yeah. First things first, got one scoop of BCAAs, like I always do, uh, it's ex from Extent, the watermelon flavor, my favorite flavor is their orange or is it mango, yeah I don't know, orange mango or something like that, but um, iHerb, the site I get it from, doesn't have these in the big containers, so that's why I go with watermelon, but their sour apple flavor is pretty damn good as well. So guys, got my potatoes in here, it's like, I don't know, almost like, yeah, three to four pounds of potatoes. I just realized that um, when I was in the US, USA, they didn't have these, so I went with tomato pasta instead, and what I realized is I had problems with cramps, and that's a clear sign for me that I'm not getting enough magnesium in because magnesium works wonders for me. Whenever I have problems with like cramps or stuff like that, I just increase my magnesium intake and they, they go away pretty much right away. And this is exactly what happened. In the USA, I had such a bad calf cramp. Man, I, I literally, it was like, I was almost about to cry. That, it, it, it did hurt so much. And so what I did is, I reintroduced potatoes in my diet and the cramps just disappeared. So just something to keep in mind guys, if you have um, trouble with cramps and so, just either supplement with magnesium or eat foods that are magnesium rich like bananas, sweet potatoes, white potatoes, all that good stuff. So guys, check with y'all later, pre-workout. Alright guys, before I forgot, just for those who are interested how I eat them, I put some Vegeta on it, I already showed you this. It's like a mix of different, of salt of course, but also of different herbs and also um, vegetable pieces. It tastes amazing. I just put this on my potatoes and I also have my, my 7-Up ready, like you see here, 7-Up light. I love this one and I eat it together, so with Vegeta and the 7-Up and I don't like to, because I want to work out in a couple of hours, I'm only getting carbs in and yeah, the few proteins that the, the potatoes basically have, but it's basically zero fat, so it, it will digest pretty fast and that's exactly what I want. All right guys, post-workout time and you know you gotta fight off the catabolic devil, so that's why I'm gonna prepare me a post-workout shake and here is what is in it. So I have here some water together with 15 grams of whey, then some baby spinach, I'll just put a handful in, then also some flake drops. This is a maple syrup flavor, very good, so I can only recommend it. It's uh, from my protein. Then also some lemon juice and some cinnamon. And I just down it. I mean, the, the shake actually tastes pretty good. Uh, I would like to actually put more whey in it, but uh, then I would go over my protein macros and I don't need more protein. And yeah, that's why I add a little bit of flavor system, just because I put a lot of spinach in there, it's such an easy way to get a lot of micronutrients in there, so yeah, to kind of neutralize the spinach, I like to add some flake drops on top of it. This is my first meal post-workout guys, I will make sure to, um, to put all the ingredients on the screen, but uh, now I'm gonna catch up on some videos while I'm eating, and then I will have to edit the video for you guys, so um, I love this meal just because it is done in like five minutes and you can always change it up, you know, use different kinds of fruits, different kind, 
kinds of flavors of your flavor system if you have one or if you don't have one just use whey protein also different kinds of cereals and you can really customize the macros to your likings if you want some more fat just add some either peanut butter or almond butter i found that my protein has some great products when it comes to this so their all natural peanut butter and their all natural almond butter are delicious guys and they're also pretty cheap so yeah, I will enjoy my meal and stay tuned for the next one. Alright guys, this is my famous bowl. Look at how much food that is. Man, I always look like a pregnant woman after I'm finished with it. But uh, no mixed berries this time around because I want to change it up. And I find it refreshing. I sometimes also um, like to add some cereal on top of it. Just to give it some crunchiness and it, it tastes even better. But um, yeah, I can't do that because I don't have enough carbs left. But uh, for dessert, I'm gonna have me a S'mores Quest Bar. I haven't tried these until the Arnold Expo. And then at the Quest booth, I got a, a few of them just because I wanted to try them out. They're the, the newest flavor. And I have to say that they're good as fuck, as Chris Jones would say. So they're, they really did a great job with this flavor. And this will then also finish off my macros. I will make sure to put them on the screen. And guys, I try to uh, keep the, these uh, full day of eating videos rather short. So I can't do a 20 minute video like uh, other bigger channels can. Just because no one would watch it. So I try to keep them at around 7 to 8 minutes. Maybe even 9. And uh, yeah guys, thanks for watching. I will make sure to put the macros on the screen. And... Tune in next time, I got great videos coming for you guys, especially a lot of uh, reviews and then also training footage. But lately I, I haven't posted a lot of training footage just because I had to train on my own. And so I didn't have anyone to hold the camera for me. So yeah, hopefully my brother and me can fix our schedules to go together to the gym. But this was it for today. Thanks as always for watching. We'll talk to you in the next one. Germ Gains. Peace out.